Okay, in this tutorial, we're going to learn how to use our split screen monitor so we can, you know, have two monitors like this. I know that I use this a lot with, uh, you know, web development. It really helps me uh, organize my work and everything like that. So I'm making this tutorial for my uh, my uh, client, Jerry Kyle. So we'll learn how to split screens like that. Okay, so the first thing that you're going to need is is a laptop kind of like this. And uh you know, usually laptops are, you know, they have a nice function on them for uh splitting the screen like that. You'll need an external to mo external monitor, something like this. And uh you'll need a cord like a monitor cord. You can also use an HDMI cable too if it's if it's uh if you have an input on your monitor as well as your laptop or uh, another computer so what we see this is the back of the monitor you can see the uh you know that's where you put the monitor plug there may be an hdmi cable plug in somewhere there too so you could use the hdmi the next thing you want to do is you want to take the other end of that cord and plug it into your laptop and you can see right down here there's a pl place for an hdmi cable if you're going to use an HDMI cable. Okay, so you'll plug that into your laptop, just like that there. The next thing you'll do is you look for a little button like this on your laptop. Sometimes you have to hold a function now, but with this particular laptop, you just have to push that button right there. And then you're going to get something like this appear on your screen. Now, you can disconnect, you can duplicate your screen, which would be the same on both screens, or you can extend the screen, which make which makes it wider like in the video that I just showed you or you can put it on the uh, the the the, mon the projector uh, monitor itself so you can, you do that and then you'll have a you know a computer set up like that where you have the split screens so that's basically all there is to it um, and then you'll be able to go from this monitor to that monitor and uh, you know utilize your workflow or you know while you're doing something on this uh, screen you could be looking at results on this screen I know a lot of times I'll code on this screen while I look at the results on this screen so and that's how you do it okay this is Max with A1 Website Pro I hope this tutorial has helped somebody out